Authorities have a monster problem on their hands in Maryborough with a large crocodile spotted in the Mary River. Tegan George is in Tyro, south of Maryborough. And Tegan, how big is this croc? Georgie, it's about three and a half metres and locals haven't seen anything quite like it in about 50 years. In 1964, two farmers actually shot a similar sized croc as it was coming out of the Mary River not far from here and that skin is actually still on display at the Bopple Historical Museum where we are tonight but thankfully the croc in the river at the moment will receive far better treatment. Authorities are hoping to relocate it if of course they can find it but the trap has been set and now all they can do is wait. With a trap in tow, rangers arrived at Beaver Rock boat ramp two kilometres from where a large crocodile has been seen basking on the banks. It appears to be in around about the three and a half metre mark. Kev Greenhalch saw the beauty of a beast sunning himself on Monday morning. But he was certainly big enough to take an animal. So I would say that he'd be big enough to take a man. Fearing for the safety of other local fishermen, he reported it to authorities. Because here in Maribara we don't, it's the furthest thing from your mind. Experts say it's surprising to see a croc this far south, but not unusual. Local fishermen have been spotting the odd salty around here for years. I couldn't believe my eyes seeing a croc here, really. Rangers have set and baited a trap, hoping to catch the croc, but at this stage they say it's not posing a threat. It's not approaching people, it's made no attempts to come. Near boat. The area is upstream from swimming spots but is used by campers looking to wet a line. The Mary River is a popular place for locals to fish on the banks but many now fear walking down to the water's edge to pull in their catch. I think it's a bit scary coming on the water's edge at night and now with this croc getting bigger. If the croc is caught it'll be relocated to a crocodile farm or a zoo. In Maryborough, Tegan George, 10 News. So a real so it really is a waiting game now for authorities. Uh, at the moment, they've got the trap out there. They've also got warning signs out there notifying the public to stay away from the area. But that trap will stay out there. They'll continue to monitor it on a regular basis. No doubt they want that trap to stay there until they can relocate this crocodile from the Mary River. Thank you, Tegan. It will be quite a catch. NAB has moved on. In